I have some scruples of conscience about whether I ought to be preserved or whether it would be charity of me to stumble. Still, still, I am not weary of life. Strangely, I have hope. You take away hope in what remains, what pleasures. Do you follow me, Thomas? Hmm? It's getting late, Father. Yeah. Let's go inside. Come here, come here. I have seen a queen of France with 18 million levers of diamonds on her person. But I declare that all the charms of her face and figure added to all the glitter of her jewels did not impress me as much as that little shrub right there. My mother always said that I never delighted enough in the mundane. But now I find if I look at even the smallest thing, my imagination begins to roam the Milky Way. Rejoice evermore. What's that, Father? Rejoice evermore. Well, it's a phrase from St. Paul, you fool. Rejoice evermore. Rejoice evermore! <laughs> oh, I wish that had always been in my heart and on my tongue. Ah. Oh. You know, I am filled with an irresistible impulse to fall on my knees in adoration. Right here. Oh, there we go. Father. <laughs> oh, if only my knees would bend like they used to. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Ugh. <sighs>